everyone's doing amazing my name is eq welcome to another episode of stonkaholics today we're going to be going over how to mine crypto from your laptop or any pc a mac anything like that i'm going to be using wink as an example but you can use this and replicate this into any coin that you want to mine through this website it's unminable.com i'll have the link in the bio and what really makes it interesting is that they allow you to mine coins that are also point of stake which technically shouldn't be a thing but because they have such a big pool they allow people to mine from their pool so it's really cool it's one of the first times that people are actually going to be able to mine coins that technically are not mineable so you can generate token by really doing nothing now before i get super deep in this video i want to reiterate this point that doing this method does not generate that much token now if you're using four or five computers you can start getting a lot but you're not going to nearly be generating as much as if you're using your gpu it's just a different power source and depending on what system you're using and what computer it is depends on how much power it's going to be generating so i'm currently running three computers right now i have my imac a uh, gaming computer windows desktop and i'm running a macbook air and then later on i'll be running a macbook pro to test all four of them to see which ones are generating the best so essentially on unminable.com you can see they have a list of tokens here that you can mine a lot of these projects have been around for a while and have been mineable but for example if you want to mine bitcoin or dogecoin you can do that cardano is going to be an interesting one clever is going to be very interesting BitTorrent is a cool one ave Wink is what we're going to be focusing on just because of the current price that it's sitting at. You can see I have my miner running here, successfully set up, and I also have it running off of my MacBook Air. And it's also running on another computer, so you can see that it is multifunctioning across the board. So let's get into setting this up. First thing you're going to want to do is decide which token you're going to want to be mining i decided to go with wink link just because it is a low value coin it's not even worth a cent right now so i can be generating a ton of these and if it does happen to hit a cent or a dollar or anything like that i'll be getting a lot higher returns than for example if i was trying to mine dogecoin or bitcoin especially so we're going to go with wink for these examples so when you get into here you're going to want to hit random x and when you go to random X, you want to hit get started with XM rig. And then you want to hit this link and open up another tab. All right. So if you're using an older Mac, the Intel's, you're going to download the X64. If you're using an M1 Mac, one of the newer ones, you're going to download the ARM64. So once you download this file, you're going to want to open your applications and then you'll want to open this file. So once you have this in your downloads, you can drag that over into your applications. It's going to install over here. So once you have XM rig here, you can click in. Now we're going to want to right click on this config file, open with text edit. So once you click into this config JSON file, you're going to want to scroll down a little bit pools. The two things we're going to be changing is the algo, which is RX and zero. Yours should say no. So make sure you change that to rx-0, keep the two parentheses. Now the URL is on the website. So you're gonna wanna go back to here and grab this link. It says like donate.something.something. You copy that and you paste this link over it. So it's rx.unminable.com. And for the username, delete everything inside as well that was there. Uh, you wanna put whatever coin you're gonna be mining. In our case, it's gonna be win going to drop your wallet address and at the end we're going to name the computer so just so we can make this a little easier to track instead of pc1 i'm going to call this imac make sure everything is done correctly and if it looks right save that file close so when you complete this step and you finish configuring the json when you go to open XM rig, it's not going to allow you to open. So what you're going to have to do is go into your system preferences, security and privacy. And then something will pop up here about this file. You're going to want to hit open anyway and allow it to open. And that will run the JSON. And then you can go back to rig, open that. Now it's going to look something like this. It's going to start going through the process. Now what you're waiting to see to make sure that it works is it'll start saying accepted. Alright, so you just got to be a little patient, but eventually you will see that you'll see an accepted order here. It had to push 
you know, almost eight jobs before it accepted the first one. So that's how you know this thing is working. Now, if you want to make sure that your wallet is connected properly, take your address, your wallet address that you put in, put it here. And when you search, something like this should pop up. Just give it a little time. If it didn't load right away, it can take 10 minutes sometimes, 15 minutes. So you can see every 1900 win, they pay you out automatically if you have it selected. If you don't, it doesn't matter. You can just let it sit in here and ride and then pay yourself out whenever it's over 1900. But you can see it's still a 1900 win minimum. Now you can see here, these are the levels that they're running at. My PC, the desktop PC is almost 2000. The iMac is running at around 300. It's low because I'm filming the video on the iMac right now. Once I turn the video off, it'll probably go back up to around 1,000. And the MacBook Air is going to be running around 5 to 800 on average. And you can see at the peak, I'm generating 4,000. Anywhere from 4,000, this is when I was turning them on and off to configure. So let's say on the low end, it was 28. And the high end, it was 44. So we'll call it 3,500. So if you want to see what that will generate you, you can go back to this page and type this in here. If I'm on random X, and I'm generating 3,500. On average, I'm going to be making 437 win a day and 13,000 win every month. Now, the more computers and stuff you add on, the stronger it is. And as well, if you add more power, I'm going to make some other videos coming soon on how to set these up. But let's say, for example, you had the same amount of power that you were running from these three computers, 3,500. The hasher is going to make you an absurd amount of these every day and every month. So you can see the power on a GPU is significantly higher than a CPU. But it is really cool to be able to mine off your laptop, off your MacBook. It's something that we haven't really been able to do before, especially when you're talking about mining coins that aren't even mineable. That's a whole nother ball game. And that about wraps up this video. We'll be circling around to unmineable again in the near future. I hope everyone has an amazing day.